everybody knows that the Philippines is a corrupt country. That's no secret. What you have to know is how to deal with it. Now it can be as simple as something like this, where you pull out your driver's license at a traffic stop, and you've got 200 pesos here, you hand that to the policeman, and it comes back without the 200 pesos. That's pretty standard all the way around the Philippines. What you have to remember though is corruption works both ways. And sometimes the police are in on it. You know, I mean they're very good about protecting you when it comes to violent crime. But, but when it comes to property, I mean it's a poor country and they're looking for a piece of the pie as well. So the thing I've learned and, and many of my friends as well is pay the first person. I don't care what kind of trouble you're in. I don't care if it was your fault. I don't care if it was somebody else's fault. Always pay the first person. Things are never going to get better. Things will only escalate as more people get involved. If there's more police, if there's more people, if you go to the policeman station, the more people involved, the more money it's going to cost you. I guarantee that. So, something goes on, anything goes on, anything is going to be cheaper than wherever you end up at the end of this. Uh, court cases as well. Court cases languish forever. So, you don't want to go there. Also, if you do end up in jail, the best advice I can give you, do not call your embassy. Because then, all the embassy will do is make sure that the country is giving you due process. Which means, you cannot buy your way out. So, the embassy watching, you are stuck in jail until it's resolved, and that can be years. Conversely, if you've got a bunch of money, I know guys stuck in jail that set up their own little cell with air con, Wi-Fi, color TV, it's not a problem for that either. So, the Philippines, it's good, it's safe here, there's not a lot of violent crime, but you got to remember it's poor. And everybody's going to want a piece of the action if you look like you've got money.